morning guys or good afternoon it's two o'clock right now and i'm currently like heading i'm in downtown brooklyn and i'm heading to a cafe to get some work done i have my shake shack with me just to keep me until dinner time and i'm filming today's video on my iphone xr so you guys can see the quality this is the front camera um yeah so let's get some work done today <laughs> I'm in cookies across the street from the cafe that I'm going to because once again I forgot to bring earphones with me and since I'm going to be editing I need earphones and I forgot to stack earphones in my bag so I'm trying to get some earphones and this is like four four five which has me a bit skeptical I'm like what if they don't work I don't, I don't think I'm taking that one I don't trust it y'all I'm over here in Primark getting distracted I came in here for a headphone and all of a sudden I'm in the baby aisle <laughs> at the cafe so I am about to head to Primark to get some shopping I want to buy a jeans because like I'm going out tomorrow with my boyfriend I think another pair of jeans would be nice especially for the summer I've had these jeans out wearing for two years now so I think it would be nice to like have on something to, to do something else try something else <laughs> I saw earlier when I came is here because these things go fast like there's never a moment where your store is empty and everybody apparently wears this wear size small so size small stuff always goes off the rocks fast this pants looks nice but I'm not sure if it's my size like it's very nice but I also want something that can be worn with like anything so the cutouts might not work <laughs>
I'm bad at editing intros. Like I know intros are so important for a video because like that's the that's the intro, that's the hook, that's the everything. I am so bad at them, y'all. <laughs> I'm so bad at intros. And I feel like this is the best intro I've ever made. Ever. And I've been on YouTube for a while. I've only started taking it seriously like this year, but I've been on YouTube for a while. And um that is the most fire intro I've ever made. And if y'all don't like that intro, I don't know. So wrong with y'all. <laughs> no, but like seriously, that is a bum ass intro. Go watch the video, guys. Go watch the video. Go watch the video. And I will only be getting better because every time I, I edit, every time I edit, I get better. So go watch the video. Anyways, I am... Um, all dressed up it's eight o'clock in the morning i'm all dressed up because i'm going downtown i have to go to work today but my boyfriend would like me to come with him to the dmv to get his um his learner's permit it's like his second attempt the first time he did it they refused him the permit because they're like oh because he did the test online and he did two tests he was only supposed to do one but he did two tests but the issue is they're supposed to like take screen grabs of your face to make sure that you're not cheating and stuff like that and they're supposed to take four pictures they only took three and because they only took three pictures they're like oh we can't give you the permit because we you, we only took three pictures of you we didn't take the full four the system something went wrong with the system and i'm like that's not his fault though that's your fault that's your problem and they don't care they send him back and now he has to take the whole thing over again. And this time I'm like, do it in person. Because do it at the DMV instead of doing it online. Because at the DMV, I don't think they can be like, oh, we're supposed to take four pictures of you. Da, 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 da. Do it under their own roof. And at the DMV, it's less questions. When you do it online, it's I think it's 50 questions. And when you do it at the DMV, it's like 20 questions. Which is so convenient, honestly. If you've studied... If you haven't studied, then do it online. <laughs> I'm joking. <laughs> I'm joking. But, um, yeah, I did my DMV test of, like, almost two years now. And I got, like, I, I finished in the first five minutes. It was so easy. I finished in five minutes, and I got, I got 17 out of 20 questions, which means I only got three wrong. Good job, Amoy. Um, and I'm currently learning how to drive. I would love to get my license by August, honestly. And I would love for him to get his license very soon, too. Because he's always like, I want a car, I want a car, I want a car. So, go get your car, boy. <laughs> this is the outfit I'm thinking of going with. You know, this is the pants I bought yesterday. And I got this top from Forever 21. I'm almost two years ago, actually. More of the mess that's happening over here. So, this is the pants. And it's my one of my favorite jeans. I don't like skinny jeans. I like jeans that kind of like flow at the end. And it's partially because I'm very curvy. Because I'm very curvy, I don't like like jeans to stick to my body too much. And yeah, that's me. I might change the top though because I feel like, you know, the titi is going to be out. And that's probably not appropriate for a government building. Even though they've probably seen worse. They've probably seen worse, but I just don't think it's too appropriate. Like I said, ignore the chaos that's going on behind me. There's this little part of my video I'm trying to find a song for. I'm using Epidemic Sound. So, I freaking love Epidemic Sound. Do you, know, do you guys know what Epidemic Sound is? So there's like, let me explain. Let the content creator, let the YouTuber, let the editor explain. I'm very excited about stuff like this because I love to edit. Even though it's like the most jarring part of the job i freaking love it i love like bringing a story together and using techniques and art to make that story happen anyways so i have like two places i get music from i was on an epidemic song free trial like i'm from like april to a few days ago it just expired so i just renewed the thing it's very expensive it's like 15 dollars a month which is honestly for somebody who's not getting paid to do this $15 a month is a lot of shmoola honestly but I was paying $20 a month for a gym I wasn't even going to so I just cancelled the gym membership and took up the epidemic song membership anyways and there's thematic so thematic is where like a lot of people get your a lot of the youtubers that I love that's where they get their music from and it's very good but the um the jazz section on 
thematic is just very limited versus the jazz section and epidemic song is just <gasps> a whole galore so it's just like what do i do because thematic is basically free even though they do have a subscription version that they're really pushing down people's throats and it has kind of limited the use of the free version but it's 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 cheaper it's seven dollars a month compared to the fifteen dollars a month so i i use I think I'm going to use them both interchangeably, but the thing with thematic is you have to put the um, the credits of the artist in your description, so I guess that's fair. And yeah, but like I freaking love Epidemic Zone. I just wish it was a little bit cheaper. It's either you go with the cheaper plan, which is like a hundred dollars a year, which is nine dollars a month, and but you have to pay it like one time, or you just pay fifteen dollars a month. I don't know my phone bill plan is coming up so i don't have that 100 dollars to pay in advance not yet anyways youtube needs to start paying me because I'm, I'm 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 a production over here <laughs> i'm a one woman production team listen i'm allowed to pop my own color i'm allowed to pop my own tags <laughs> i'm joking <laughs> no i'm not those are the expenses i take on to make this an enjoyable experience for you guys so you know like comment share subscribe that would be nice that would be nice that would be nice yeah yeah mm -hmm. <laughs> tell everybody <laughs> please <laughs>